cops going in here? Yeah. Uh, we're on this side, and like I was told them before, and the cops said, as long as you're not going down the main yeah. road, no problem. Because the highway is considered fence line to fence line. So Taylor Kid actually extends right to here. You see that telephone pole down there? Yeah. And you see the ditching and how they maintain it? So a highway to, or fence line to fence line is considered the highway. So you guys are actually on the highway right now. Yeah. So license, insurance, plate, yeah. helmet. Okay. All that stuff, right? Yeah. Now, when I see guys, uh, if you were over there when I saw you right now, sure. and you were going up the, sh the side of the shoulder there, I'd be like, they got a helmet on? See you later. Yeah. But the problem is you're on this side, and I know that a lot of guys live down in there, yeah. and they don't want to trailer them or truck yeah. them just 100 meters. Or a couple like hundred yards, meters. understandable. But it's still in violation of the bylaw. Absolutely, yeah. And I'm glad you stopped, because most guys, sometimes there's 15-year-old kids on here. Oh, of course. They run every time. Yeah. Well, catch I'm 40. There's what's what's you know like. Come on now, I got so, three kids and like I. You got a plate. You got a helmet on. Yeah. Stuff like that. This yeah. Is only like he doesn't just, just got delivered right now. Just yeah. delivered. Yeah. Oh, it looks nice. Yeah. I mean, I'm not charging anybody today. No, you no. Guys, I'm just trying to make you aware. Yeah. Of yeah. Information. Yeah. You know. So, I mean, we'll have a look. Yeah. What are the odds, yeah. eh? Yeah. 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 So there's nice areas to ride and stuff like that around here. It just they don't want anybody south of Taylor Kid. Right. And they put the signs up, there's one right there, no ATVs. I'd never even noticed that thing before. Yeah. As I stopped yeah. you within uh, 20 meters of the sign. Oh, I hear you. Oh. Yeah. Anyway. And I get that you don't want to trailer them just to come to here. Yeah. Well, we have respect for the people in the road, we're just staying in the deck. Yeah. yeah. I agree. Yeah. Well, we very much appreciate, uh, you know. But when people make, like I just saw you guys when I pulled up, but if somebody made a complaint, Yep. I got to do something better than yep. that point, yep. right? Yeah. Yep. So yep. right now it's more about education. Now you guys know. Lots of guys still creep up and down or try and get through, and you know, because they live right here on yep. on the west side. Yeah. And they don't want to trail them or truck yep. them. I get it. Yeah. But they've made a law for a reason. Yep. It's, yeah. It's a bylaw, actually. Yeah. Just five years ago, they changed the law so that you can go up and down county roads. Okay. Yeah. Even I know. Yeah. Yeah. Or yeah. Across to the yeah. Kid. yeah. Oh. Even in the ditch. It's about respect more than anything. No matter where you're riding, it's just yeah. Yeah. you're not ripping people's lawns, you're not jumping the driveways, you're not pissing people off, and yeah. you just, you know, you go out to have fun and, and stay off OFSC trail. There you go. We like to sled too, so yeah. we know enough to stay out of the tracks. And my and, favorite part of sledding is that trail pass where guys, uh, you may have heard this before, but you buy a trail pass, they're over 200 bucks. I right? think they're 500 now, aren't they? Sure. I think they yeah, are. It's been a long time since I've yeah, I'm pretty one. sure they're 500 bucks is that now. The season? Yeah. yeah. Oh yeah, so, so wouldn't it, be bad if they would connect all of Ontario trails, but it's not. Oh, That's only giving you a pass for an area. And so you guys work opposite weekends, let's say, at your jobs. Yeah. And you buy one trail pass, yeah. and you go out on your sled this weekend, and you give it to him next weekend, it's in your coat. Well, the regulation says it must be affixed to your sled. Well, I was going to say, it's got to be registered to a machine. There's yeah. no way. You put on a big old chill. number on your sled. On the windshield. Yeah. And I used to stop guys who had it in their pocket. Sure. Because I didn't see it on the windshield. Yeah. And I'd be like, where's your trail pass? And they'd be like, oh, it's right here in my pocket. I'd be like, then affix it to where it's supposed to go. Yeah, absolutely. And you just see the guys just doubled right over. He's like, oh my God, Joe's going to kill me here. And he peels it off and he sticks it on there. He just like barely lays it on there. And that's usually when I bump up to the machine and just start going, oh yeah, get it on there. Push it down. Nice and hard. You know, like that. This is going to be a fix to the machine? Just see the guys uh, just like, oh yeah. my god, this is so embarrassing. Yeah, that's hilarious. Anyway. Oh. Well, I do appreciate it. I'll right, let you guys I'd... keep going. Uh, my name's Martel. Yeah, I we saw chase that. ATVs around here as yeah. much as we can to try yeah. and catch kids and stuff. But yeah. not, not legal ATV riders. Yeah, well, I appreciate you know? that. We the do pay an awful lot. Yeah. Toys. Yeah. I wish yeah. I could do it. Well, well you yeah. should. No, I You should. Someday. You can. And then I'm going to buy a truck and a trailer. Yeah, I know. Anyway, guys, go ahead. All right. Well, now you know. Just when you get to the divide line here, yeah. people are watching and it's, it is an offense. It's All right, very much also. appreciate it. Stay safe, eh? Okay. Okay, fella. Thanks for stopping. No worries, no worries.
girl boy.